Okay, well, I've been working with um, different ones of my pulse motors to see if I could make a motor that would run uh, the cars down the floor better. And these uh, Newman motors, or what they call a window motor, are pretty torquey. And so I put this together. I'm just calling this a simple motor with torque. And it's just one winding that goes around like this. And then I tapped into this top coil for the LED. See that flashing? And it's just got a simple uh, commutator uh, using the steel shaft. Um, this is the solid contact and this is the make and break. And what you do is you paint the shaft and then make an open area right there where the contact takes place. And this is just a 10 farad 2.7 volt super capacitor. Here's me and here's the date. Now I pre-charged that with uh, 3 volts. And so what the reason I'm doing this is to save weight. And I'm not going to run this very long on that floor, but just long enough to see what's going on. And you save a lot of weight by using a super capacitor instead of 3 volts. But um, that's just a capacitor sitting on the shaft there. And uh, what it is, it's just a bunch of magnets on a piece of coat hanger wire. And the uh, contact goes through here, over to here. You see that white line there? That's a white out correction fluid. And then it's just scraped off in one spot where the um, magnets are in a situation where they're between the coils. So you get the big torque. And that's what I'm looking for is the torque in order to turn a wheel on a car. So anyway, this is where I'm heading with my little um, car project to run down the floor is a homemade motor that has enough torque to get the job done. Um, and this might do it. I haven't decided exactly yet if this is what I want to do, but this looks like a pretty good way to go um, if I do it right. And I might be able to use a paper towel tube as the chassis and the motor and then just put the uh, probably a pulley on this down to a big wheel pulley to run the car down the road. Anyway, that's uh, what I've been up to. I've been working with these little um, pulse motors that I have to see if I can make one that will uh, power our little car. Thanks for watching.